Vlog on. Uh, welcome to the vlog. This is the vlog. Vlog of Ben. Uh, this is uh, Thursday, the 23rd of the year 2023 in February. I've never done um, dates like that. It's not like something I do, so don't be concerned. Uh, okay. Hello. Um, we're vlogging today. No trendies today. It's okay. Next week, though, we're going to hit 365. How many days are in here? 364, 365, or 366? 360, 365 days? I don't know. But we're going to hit a full year's worth of trends next week, which will be something. Some kind of an accomplishment. It is so cold. Um, but today... Uh, on this Thursday, we have a new release of a Mike and Ben episode, and I'll show you a sneak peek here. Sneak peek. Hey, I'm Ben Goldsmith, Ben Jaja, Feather the Third. I'm a YouTuber, a server, and I work at Amazon Delivery. I definitely don't want to kill myself. Thanks, Amazon. Done with the peek. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so we're swinging. We're taking a, a large... A large bat and swing in a hard swing. Um, you know, this one was, uh, I was just like thinking about like, I saw these ads that Amazon put out like on Instagram reels and they were just kind of like coming through on my phone and I just noticed they were like these actors, obviously actors getting paid to you know, play these Amazon employees, and every one of them was just like, my name's Kathy, and I wanted to be a software engineer. And until I started working at Amazon, now I can. Thanks, Amazon. And it was just like that one and like another one, which was just like, my name's Charlotte. And I didn't know what I was doing with my life. And then I started working at Amazon Delivery, and... Now my life's great. Thanks so much, Amazon. And I was just like watching these things and I was like, there's no way that all these people are that happy working at Amazon. I'm barely happy working on the things that I love doing the most in life. So could you imagine? I mean, like, anyway, I guess what I'm trying to say is like we're at this time right now in society where we're being censored for saying like if people are on social media or like putting out videos and saying they want to unalive themselves they have to do just that they have to say they have to unalive themselves because um it's getting flagged or it's getting taken down or something like that but what if people just need to communicate how they're feeling and what if that's how they're feeling and if we're not allowed to communicate the way that we're feeling because computers are hearing the words we're saying and then taking away the content, well then we're being censored from um, we're being censored from kind of this technological vantage point, but we're also being censored from corporations and stuff like that. Like, how are people really feeling at Amazon? So we made this sketch to kind of um, I don't know lean into lean into the censorship of of life right now and and I guess that's why we made it. Also we just think it was funny. <laughs> I mean I, there's nothing worse than going to like the improv on a Tuesday or Sunday night when they're doing like open mic night or like three minute set night when we you get your name drawn out of a hat. There's nothing more depressing on this planet Earth than going to one of those shows and that's because they're just calling comedians out of the hat <laughs> and like every comedian is just talking about their suicidal thoughts and ideations and it's like this really really thank you uh the coffee machine thank you is telling me that it's ready but these people uh like one after the other will just go up and like do their like three minute material about how suicidal they are or depressed they are, and, you know, these are mostly comedians, um, and, you know, that are just, like, earlier on in their comedy stages, or younger sometimes, they're just expressing themselves on stage for three minutes, 
And it usually comes out like that. And so it's like, you know, I don't know. I think as somebody who's had suicidal thoughts, ideations, myself, living this in this world, I've had friends um, that have committed suicide. I've had people in my life close to me, family, um, close to th that as well. I've, you know, it's touched us all. So to like pretend like it doesn't exist or to ice skate around the elephant on the ice and just like put our heads away and turn from it, I don't think that that's something we should do. I think we should acknowledge it, talk about it, and not be censored from talking about it because what if the video that somebody puts out talking about it might help save their life and then might help them get into recovery or become recovered? You never know. So anyway, that's the vlog for the day. Uh, 12.30 today, noon, 30. New Mike and Ben at Dumb Owl. I'll see you there and I'll hopefully stop itching. Why am I itching? Vlog off.